live from the local station. News 4 Jax starts now. 800 people are now hospitalized with COVID-19 here in Duval County as local doctors and politicians both stress the vital importance of getting vaccinated. The message is even more blunt, however, coming from those who are now in intensive care and are wishing they had received the vaccine. Stay safe, protect each other. We're in it together, so that's the only way we can beat this is everybody as a group. Today, Governor DeSantis also said the key to stopping this surge in hospitalizations is to step up the statewide rate of vaccinations. And right now, about 48% of Floridians are fully vaccinated. News for Jack's reporters Jim Pigott and Scott Johnson are covering local hospitalizations and the push to get the vaccine in more arms. We begin with Jim, who spoke with that patient you just heard from in the ICU. For me, this is an experience, being on the ICU and meeting this gentleman inside this room. This is James, who has COVID and wants to tell you something. <coughs> <coughs> for yourself, your loved ones, everyone, get vaccinated because I'm used to the strong protector and I'm, it definitely broke me down to very humbled. This virus is, it's nothing to joke about. James Owen, like many of us, thought he wouldn't get sick, but from his bed at UF Health North, the 41-year-old told me how he ended up here in intensive care. We had a uh, Fourth of July party and uh, the fifth, I got sick. Now, 17 days after the party, James is here. His wife is also ill, but not hospitalized. I'm doing much better now. It's been a rough road, but we're getting there. <laughs> and James is far from alone on this ward. It's been rough for him and other patients and for the staff as well. Caitlin Thompson is a registered nurse in the ICU. We're tired, we're exhausted as a staff, as a healthcare facility. Um, our patients are younger, they're sicker. Her colleague, Anita Wall, agrees. These people are in the prime of their life. These are hearty, healthy people. And you know, I've had folks that are saying, I just didn't think I would get that sick because I'm healthy. You are until you catch COVID. James echoes that belief. After the party on the 4th, he thought it was just a hangover until he had trouble breathing. At first, I thought I could take care of it myself at the house. I was sadly mistaken and <laughs> landed me here. James is grateful to the staff and believes they have gone out of their way to help him. The staff now says this intensive care unit reminds them of something else. I feel like we're in a war and that war is not ending anytime soon yet because people aren't getting vaccinated yet. And being retired Navy, James can relate to that. After what I've been through, I'm definitely going to get it as soon as I'm cleared. <laughs> Jim Pigott, Channel 4, The Local Station.